Do you know the early warning signs of a heart attack? This is a question we should all be able to answer. Heart attacks are a leading cause of death, with around 805,000 people experiencing one each year in the United States alone. That's roughly one heart attack every 40 seconds. These numbers are staggering, but there is a silver lining. Heart attacks have distinct symptoms and recognizing these early can make all the difference. Immediate treatment can not only save lives, but also prevent lasting damage to the heart muscle. It's important to understand that heart attacks can happen to anyone at any time. They're often caused by coronary artery disease, a condition where plaque builds up in the arteries, blocking the flow of blood to the heart. But lifestyle factors like smoking, high blood pressure, obesity, and a sedentary lifestyle can also increase your risk. Don't wait until it's too late. Familiarize yourself with the early warning signs of a heart attack. Knowing these signs can save a life, maybe even your own. So what are these early warning signs of a heart attack that we need to look out for? Let's dive right in. One of the most common signs is chest discomfort. This isn't always an intense, gripping pain like you might imagine. It can feel like pressure or a squeezing sensation in the center of your chest. It might even feel like heartburn or indigestion. Importantly, this discomfort can come and go. It doesn't have to be constant. Next, there's fatigue. Not the everyday tiredness we all experience from time to time, but an unexplained persistent fatigue that doesn't seem to be tied to any particular activity. It's a kind of weariness that makes even simple tasks feel overwhelming. Shortness of breath is another red flag. This can occur with or without chest discomfort. It's a feeling of being winded, like you've just run a marathon, even if you're just sitting still. Now here's a crucial point to remember. Not everyone experiences these signs. Some people have silent heart attacks with no clear symptoms at all. And when it comes to women, the warning signs can be different. In fact, a survey from 2003 found that less than 30% of women who survived a heart attack had experienced chest discomfort a month before their event. Instead, women are more likely to experience other symptoms, such as dizziness, lightheadedness or fainting, pain in the back, neck, jaw or throat, or even flu-like symptoms like cold sweats or nausea. Just remember, if you or someone else experiences these signs, don't hesitate to seek help immediately. It's always better to be safe than sorry. The sooner a heart attack is treated, the better the chances for recovery. Remember, these signs can occur even a month before an actual heart attack. Now that we know the early warning signs, what can we do to prevent heart attacks and how are they treated? Prevention is the best cure, as they say, and it holds true for heart attacks. There are several controllable factors that can impact heart attack risk. Lifestyle choices play a significant role in this. For instance, Maintaining a heart-healthy diet, keeping a healthy weight, engaging in regular exercise and avoiding smoking can all significantly lower the risk of a heart attack. Now, when it comes to treatment, there are several options available. These may involve surgical intervention, such as angioplasty or bypass surgery, where blocked arteries are opened or circumvented to restore blood flow to the heart. Medical devices like stents might also be used to keep these arteries open. Apart from these, Medications play a crucial role in both the immediate treatment and ongoing management of heart health post a heart attack. These can include drugs to dissolve clots, manage heart function, or control factors like high blood pressure and cholesterol that contribute to heart disease. By making heart healthy choices and recognizing the early warning signs, we can increase our chances of living a long, full, active life.